We'll put a little. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, welcome back. It is the best time of the year, okay? It is the best time of the year when it comes down to shopping at Sephora. And I say that because Sephora is having their spring savings event, which if y'all don't know about the spring savings event, girl, where you been? This is literally the best time to pick up your favorite products, products you've been wanting, products that have been on your wish list, simply because you are gonna be saving. And I wanna show you guys some of the new products that have launched on Sephora, which are in this box that you can get at the spring savings event. And before we get into that, I wanna thank the team over at Sephora for sponsoring today's video. Now, let me talk about the spring savings event before I actually show you guys the products because some of you probably have never shopped the events at Sephora. Now, the spring savings event is gonna start on April 1st. So by the time this video goes up, it's gonna already be happening. Um, so April the 1st through April the 11th. And you have to be a beauty insider to shop this event. If you're not a beauty insider, I do have the link down below. It's free to sign up. It literally takes two seconds. Well, not two seconds, but it takes less than five minutes to sign up. Now, if you shop at Sephora a lot, like I do, I know a lot of you do, and I also know a lot of you are rouge like I am. So if you are rouge, you are able to shop this event starting on April the 1st, which means you will get 20% off. If you are VIB, you are able to shop the event starting April the 5th through the 11th, which you will get 15% off. And then if you're an insider, which you literally can be an insider right now as I speak, if you sign up. So you'll be able to shop the event starting on April 7th through the 11th and you'll get 10% off. So with all of that being said, go ahead and sign up to be an insider if you have not already. It is so easy. I I have the link down below in the description. Just do it, girl. I know there are some products at Sephora that you wanna get and you wanna save some coins on those products. So go ahead and sign up. Like I said, I have the link down below in the description. But now let's talk about what is in this box, girl. Let's just put the box up here. Hopefully y'all don't fall down. Um, ooh, we have a couple of black owned brands that I wanna share. Briogeo, y'all, I love the Briogeo. I think it's called the avocado hair mask. It comes in the green tub. A lot of y'all know this cause I talk about it a lot. But um, I wanted to try this out. This is the Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Rice Water. Well, it's the Mega Strength Rice Water Protein and Moisture Strengthening Treatment. So I actually purchased this a few weeks ago. This is what the bottle looks like. Really, really cute. And I use it once already. And when I tell y'all, when I run the comb through my hair, now I use this on my natural hair. When I run the comb through it, it's almost like I put butter in my hair. Now, when I use it, I left it in for when I didn't just put it in and then rinse you know comb my hair and then rinse it out I left it in for a few hours um and you can actually leave this in overnight I think it said that on um yeah it says after shampooing wring hair of excess water and apply the treatment evenly throughout the damp hair leave in for at least 10 minutes I left mine in for a few hours <laughs> um or longer overnight as desired this is just a really good treatment if you feel like your hair is too dry or if you have damaged hair this has been really 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 good even though i used it once i will say that i like how my hair felt so i chose to get this because for one my hair is really like it can get really 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 dry and really crunchy you know so i wanted something that was going to help with that and i read the reviews on this and the reviews are great from what i've read um, so yeah, I've really been enjoying this. I haven't worn it overnight. I just worn it for, I think I had it in for about two or three hours. Um, but I do want to try it overnight to see how I like it. But if you guys have tried this hair treatment, let us know. But so far, so far I've been liking it. Um, and then I also got, ooh, this is my first time trying anything from this brand. This is the Hyper um, Hyper Even Brightening Dark Spot Vitamin C Serum. And this is also from a black owned business. Y'all, y'all know I love me a serum and I cannot wait to try this out. So let's see. Whatever. So, okay, so I noticed that they had two sizes on there. I got the one fluid ounce and this is how it looks really cute and then there is like a little pump on there so it so says it has vitamin c turmeric um choic acid apple enzyme bear berry and hyaluronic acid so sounds good you guys sounds really really good 
so I'm excited. Okay, y'all. This next thing, this is my third box of these pads, y'all. It's the Dr. Dennis Gross Extra Strength Daily Peel Pads. Mm, 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 mm. If you want baby bottom smooth skin, if you want something that's gonna help with hyperpigmentation, if you want something that's gonna help with texture, just go ahead and put these in the cart. These have worked wonders on my skin. I use them every single night. So it comes in a pack of two. Let me open it so y'all can see how they come. This one is the 30 day, yep, the 30 day with five, um, five bonus treatments in it. So this is how it looks, comes with two pads. So the first one, you rub it all over your face and you let it sit there for two minutes before you put the second one on. And your, like, your actual skin doesn't peel. I know some some people may look at this and be like, oh, I don't want my skin, you know, I don't want my skin to peel. I don't want, you know, to walk around with skin coming off my face. Obviously, it is a peel. It's a daily peel, but your skin, you're not going to see your skin peeling is what I'm trying to say. Um, so if you have oily skin or imperfections, uneven skin tone, texture, wrinkles, or enlarged pores, this is going to be for you. And I also grabbed, okay, this was actually on my wish list. This is the Jeanette. <laughs> Sol Genario Beha Floor Elastic Cream. So this is the new one, the pink one. And I got the smaller size because I didn't know if I would like it or not. This is um, 2.5 fluid ounce. So I'm going to open it and smell it. I've seen mixed reviews on this, but I want to see how it smells for myself, you know? So let's try it out. It's not my favorite. I actually like the Bumdia Bright better, like the smell of it. The one that comes in the red container, but I'm honestly not mad at the smell. It's not really strong. Let me put some on because I kind of need some on my elbows. But why do I feel like this smells like some perfume that I have? What is it? It almost, okay, it doesn't smell like it, but it kind of in a way reminds me of it. It kind of smells like Burberry Her, and that's actually one of my favorite fragrances, but it doesn't, I mean, it doesn't smell like it, but it kind of, it kind of reminds me of it in a way. Hmm. Now that I have it on, it actually smells better. Like it smells better on my skin than smelling it in the little jar, but y'all, I'm not mad at this. Okay. Okay. I actually, I actually like it. I think this will go great with Burberry Hair though. So to um, mix it in, why do I feel like the more I smell it, I can definitely smell, like I can definitely see it reminding me of Burberry Hair. If you smell Burberry Hair, and if you smelled this before, let me know if I'm tripping because <laughs> it's kind of giving Burberry her in a way. Okay, she's cute. She is cute. So I will let y'all know if I like this because I need to actually, you know, put it on the body to see if it actually gives me the moisture that I want and need. So, oh, it does have, it says it's enriched with retinol and mimicking cacao oil and plant collagen. Hmm. Yeah, the more I smell it, it is definitely reminding me of Burberry hair, but it's not as strong as, it's like almost a really, really, really toned down version of Burberry hair. I know that doesn't make sense, but if you smell this and if you have Burberry hair or if you've smelled Burberry hair, then I feel like you'll probably get what I'm saying. So anyway, um, next, okay, this was also on my wish list. It is the Kula Organic do good illuminating serum i did a what's in my sephora cart and this was one also this this was also in my sephora cart i am very 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 excited for this more so because of the bottle like oh my gosh it's so freaking cute it's like a pink iridescent is this glass i think it is I know I shouldn't be getting stuff just for the packaging, but I could not resist this. It's so pretty. 
Ah, oh, it's so pretty. Okay, let's squirt a little bit out on the hand and see how it looks. I wanna see if it's gonna give me a white cast or not. So let's see. I squirted a really small amount of it. So I feel like a little bit is gonna go a long way and we're gonna have to really rip this in. Okay, I don't smell any, uh, I don't know. Cause I still smell that, um, ooh. I still smell that, um, that body cream, but oh my gosh, wow. Okay, at first I was a little worried because I felt like I couldn't rub it in, but oh my gosh, this glow. Are you guys seeing this glow? Okay. It's really, really pretty and glowy. Wow. Ooh, I like it. I like it. Okay, yes, 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 yes. I really like this. Ooh, and it has, um, it says it fe uh, it's featuring a blue screen in it, which is good for, you know, if you sit in front of computers all day. So that's nice. Very excited. Ooh, K skin. Y'all, I keep smelling this right here. And the more it sits on my skin, the more I like it, which is crazy. Mm. Oh, it smells so good now, y'all. That's so crazy. Like when I first opened it, I was like, mm. But when I put it on and rubbed it in, and now that it's sitting on my skin, it's definitely giving Burberry her. I'm not even going to lie, y'all. It is giving Burberry her. So let me know if I'm tripping, <laughs> if you smell this. And then if you have Burberry her, let me know if you smell the same. But anyway, Winnie Harlow's brand, K-Skin, is on Sephora. I was going to get the SPF, but I figured... I already have an SPF that I'm using right now, which is the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow. And then obviously I wanted to try this one out. This was um, the one that was on my uh, wish list, the Kula um, Illuminating Serum. But I don't have any lip products that have SPF in it. So I wanted to try out the Sun Care. It's called the, well, it's the Sun Care. Um, well, it's called the Isle Lip Balm. It has SPF 30 in it. So I wanted to give this a try and plus it was something that I needed because I don't have any lip products with SPF in it. And I actually got another lip product in this haul that I'm going to show you that has, um, that has SPF in it. But how cute is the tube? It's so cute. So cute. Okay. I have lip stick on my lips, but ooh, is this kind of like the Summer Fridays lip? Like, you know how they updated their lip balm? um oh yeah it is like a rubber applicator nice i'm gonna put a little oh my gosh this smells like a legit vanilla cupcake oh my gosh y'all i want to eat this so bad i'm gonna put it on my lips because i mean it's clear but oh my gosh this literally smells like vanilla cupcakes mmm Mm, it's so smooth and buttery mm. Mm, and it's not sticky either. It's so smooth and buttery. I like this. I like this y'all. All right, y'all. Another product that was on my wish list is the Dior Backstage Flash Perfector Concealer. So I went with the shade 5W. I don't know if this is gonna be a good shade, but just looking off, um, just looking at the swatches, I thought this one might work. So this is what it looks like. Let's see how it looks. This is supposed to have like a brush applicator. Yep, it's like a brush applicator. Let me see. Hmm, okay. I think it'll work. I think that color will work. I don't know if it'll be like a good brightening concealer, but we'll, we'll try it out. We're gonna see how it looks on the face because I want to do a um, get ready with me testing a few new products and I'll definitely test that out with you guys. Okay, this next product was actually an influence. Um, I was watching McKenna Walker. I feel like every time I want to watch anything self-care related or like a shower routine or anything like that, I'm always running to her channel. So this is what she used in one of her self-care videos and I had to get it because 
I just had to. It's from the Sephora collection. It's called the Cooling Body Roller. And she used this on her face. She says she puts it in the um, uh, refrigerator to make it, you know, cold. So, you know, I want to try it out for myself. Um, okay, I don't want to break my nail. But this is, I mean, you guys can see it right here. This is what it looks like. You just roll it on your face. And since it, I mean, it does say a body roller. So I'm assuming you can. Well, obviously, you can roll it on your body. It says, um, this cooling body roller gently reduces the appearance of puffiness, which is what I need in the morning times, especially on my face. Um, and it is believed to have a cooling effect on the skin. Y'all, okay, we're getting off subject. Girl, put this in your cart. Every time I move around, I'm smelling it, and it smells incredible. Oh, my gosh. Put this in your cart right now. When you first smell it, you're going to be like, mmm but when you put it on oh my gosh um okay back to this but yeah it says <laughs> um it reduces the appearance of puffiness and is believed to have a cooling effect on the skin um yeah so i am excited to try this out use it on my self-care days and we're almost done y'all we are almost done what is this oh another product that was on my wish list it is the westman atelier face trace contour stick so they came out with another shade y'all and it's supposed to complement deeper complexions this one is called ganache did i say that right i probably did not but oh this is thicker than what i thought like the i thought it was going to be skinnier than this but this is nice okay so this is the shade and i want to try it out i mean it is a contour stick but i also want to try to see if it looks good as a cream bronzer so there's the color right that actually looks good oh my gosh y'all wow yeah i want to see how it looks as a cream bronzer on the face so we're gonna be trying this out too y'all i'm excited i am a very 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 excited i didn't get makeup like that like i got the concealer and then i got the um contour stick but now that i look at everything else like we got a lot of self-care stuff which i have been really into lately anyway but anyway um okay so remember i told you guys that i wanted like i needed like lip products with spf so i got the k skin and i also got another one this is a new product on sephora it's the kula um lip lux hydrating oil and it has spf 30 so i saw this on sephora and i was like "Ooh, that's cute and how cute is it let's open and see okay i don't i don't smell it right now i'm still smelling that body butter that i put on but i don't really smell anything here i mean it's clear i don't know why i'm swatching it but this feels very um i don't want to say watery but it doesn't feel as thick as some of the lip oils that i have like the one from k skin feels thicker than this one this one feels really really thin that's the word really really thin yeah i can't smell anything right now because i still smell <laughs> i still smell that body butter but okay oh okay and she's cute she's cute so i got that and then i also got the laneige okay this is a i think they reformulated this this is the water bank blue hyaluronic cream moisturizer so they have new packaging and i think they just reform it oh it has a little stick that comes with it i think they just reformulated this because they already had the water bank moisture cream but this is the new packaging how cute and you open it and then the product is in there how sticking cute is this packaging though i think i like this one better than the original one and i will say the original water bank cream is good so i'm expecting this to be even better if not the same so we're gonna see we're gonna see and then the very last thing i got is the skin fx this is also another product that was on my wish list it is the skin F why do i I don't know why I say skin effects, skin fix. Skin fix resurface HA BHA renewing cream. I cannot wait to try this out. So I tried the um the exfoliator that everybody loves, and for some reason it just did not work out for me. I got a lot of bumps on my chest, so I had to stop using it. But I'm excited to try this out. 
I cannot wait. Let's see if it just has a smell. Y'all know I like to smell everything. <laughs> Let's see. I don't smell anything. I'm still smelling that body butter though. I don't smell this. So I'm, I'm assuming this is like fragrance free. But I'm excited! All right, girl, that is it. That is everything that I wanted to share in this Sephora haul. I hope y'all enjoyed. Let me know what is in your cart because I am nosy and you guys know I am gonna be shopping this event again and be on the lookout for another haul because there is going to be another haul. But that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you again to Sephora for sponsoring this video. And don't forget, if you are not signed up to be an insider, go ahead and sign up right now. The link is down below for you guys. But that is all. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give me a huge thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed if you're not subscribed already. And I'll see you guys in my next one.